Ladies and most gentlemen, today we're going to talk about Death Knights, and more specifically, we're going to talk about the brand new Eye Glow, which is coming to the game in patch 8.3 of Visions of Nazoth. So, Blizzard did make a blue post about this recently, saying that they were making some back end changes to the way that Eye Glow works in the game for Blood Elves and Death Knights. And then we saw a build which kind of made it look a little bit weird. I'll show a picture here. It did look kind of strange. Wasn't very happy about that. But in the latest build, as of last night, we did get a better look at these changes. And personally, I think it looks really good. So let's take a look at the human right here. And we can see that the eye glow is brand new. You have a new kind of blue outline on it with the white on the inside. You're probably looking at this going... Dan, it looks exactly the same. What are you talking about? So if we put it right next to the retail version as of right now, you can really see the difference. And obviously in the retail version, it's quite a lot glowier, kind of like headlights, I guess you could say. The 8.3 version being a little bit more subtle and a lot nicer in my opinion. I think it looks great, actually. And this also includes Allied Races and Pandaren. So we will take a look at them in a moment because they all have their brand new eye glow in the game so we'll check out that customization in a moment but yeah looking through some of these races i think it does look really really good i think it suits them and eye glow is something that hasn't really changed since wrath of the lich king so this change has been needed for a very long time and it even looks really good in game actually i think in the character screen it looks pretty good but actually in game around other npcs and obviously the npcs have had their eyes changed as well all of the death Eye npcs that is and blood elf and high elf and whatever any NPC with any eye glow, basically, and I think it looks good. And they made this change due to the customization changes coming in Shadowlands, which could potentially mean that we will have a slider for eye color, possibly. Don't quote me on that, but there's there's very, you know, there's a chance of that if they're messing around with the eyes. Uh, but yeah, so that's what it looks like on some of the cool races. Now, if we jump over to the allied races, as I said, these now do have their brand new Death Knight eye glow. Now, obviously, it's things like Void Elves and Zandalari don't actually have any differences. I would say Zandalari, you've really got to look hard to see if there's any differences between the Death Knight version and the regular version. I'm pretty sure it's basically identical. But things like Lightforge Draenei now have the blue glow uh, on their races, and it looks pretty cool on a Lightforge. Lightforge basically looks like a Draenei when it doesn't have the yellow glowing eyes, but... Yeah, I mean, my personal favorite has to be the Dark Iron Dwarf. Look at this guy, man. So normally they have the red fiery eyes, as you've probably seen before. The Death Knights now have this blue eye effect, which looks really, really good on the male and the female, of course. And personally, I think all of the eye glows look really, really good. And I'm a fan. I'm a fan. So if we take a look at the Kul Tiran here see the female with the eye glow the male also looking really good the male actually being one of the examples we got when we uh, saw it at blizzcon when they first announced that allied races were going to be death knights uh, take a look at the high mountain tauren here as well looking really cool looking really mean with that brand new eye glow with kind of the white center the blue on the outline i prefer it i really do i think the original one kind of looked like headlights and this is a lot subtler, and I really do like the effect that they're going for with this, but, you know, the best one, of course, has to be the Volpira. so, yep, yep, that's happening, yep, we're getting Volpira Death Knights, guys, first time around, don't have to wait, when we first get the Volpira, they're gonna be able to be Death Knights, guys, so, this is your Volpira Death Knight, kinda looks a bit soulless, a bit mean, a bit crazy, especially the female looks kind of like... I don't know, like, rapid. It's kind of uh, a little bit scary, actually. Uh, Mechanomes as well, weirdly enough. Uh, even though we've just in in met them, they're going to become Death Knights straight away. Uh, you can see here, all of the original uh, customization options are available for all of the races. There is no brand new skin colors as of right now for any of the uh, the allied races or Pandaren, unfortunately. Uh, Makar, of course, being a massive one for me, I think look absolutely fantastic as Death Knights. You really, you know, you put that darker skin color on there and uh, with, the, with the upright, it's just, that is a mean, mean looking boy. And I think we're gonna get a lot of Maghard Death Knights. We did get a tease of Maghard Death Knights in Island Expeditions and we're finally getting them in patch 8.3. And Nightborn again, have a natural eye glow. They do have a little bit of a different eye glow here with the Death Knight appearance, but I think they kind of suit Death Knights weirdly enough. They, I don't know, they look, kind of neat even though they i mean they're basically just night elves essentially they're they're rigging so yeah they kind of uh they sue it quite nicely personally 
And finally, we'll take a look at the Pandar. And of course, of course, as you can see, a brand new little interface here. You get to choose between Horn Alliance straight away. And uh, there is the options for the male Pandar and uh, all the original options that you would have had previously. And of course, here's the female as well with that brand new eye glow. I think some of the eye glows do actually kind of look a little bit squinty. We look at this one in particular, doesn't look that bold I guess I guess with the original glow it kind of glowed outside of the actual eyeballs but these are very much uh, contained inside the actual eye of the uh, of the creature but things like the female Pandaren have much larger eyes so it makes it a lot more prominent but the male Pandaren a little bit squinty but still pretty nice and quite subtle so it's not too bad unfortunately we can't make these characters as oh my goodness that helm wow Unfortunately, we can't make these characters right now because they haven't activated on the PTR. As of right now, we cannot take a look at any of these starting zones, unfortunately, but that's going to come hopefully pretty soon. I mean, they're either going to do it in the PTR or they're just going to launch it on day one of 8.3. We'll have to see. But guys, that's pretty much it. That is a preview of the brand new Eye Glow, which has come to the game in patch 8.3, Visions of Nazoth. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I, As I said, it is a work in progress. There's a chance they might do some more changes to it. I think this looks pretty much what we're going to get, in my opinion. I actually think it's a much better change. It looks way better than the headlights that we previously had, but guys, do let me know down below what you think of these brand new Death Knight Eye Glow, and whether or not you're going to choose a Death Knight going into 8.3, going into Shadowlands. There's a lot of love coming to that, that class, and hopefully some good class changes to come along with it. So, guys, before I go, I'd like to give a massive shout-out to my amazing patrons, YouTube channel members, and Twitch subs. You guys are awesome. If you'd like to support the channel in any of those ways, links are down below. So leave a like on this video, guys, if you liked it, and subscribe if you haven't. I've also got a partner Discord channel with over 3,000 members, and I'm now streaming on twitch.tv slash MrGM. We actually did check all this out on stream uh, today on twitch.tv slash MrGM. So if you want to check me out on stream, check out the PTR, check out Classic, check out everything that's going on in World of Warcraft, twitch.tv slash MrGM. And with that, guys, I'll see you next time.